All right, and we're moving very quickly now from that story to a story down in Karnataka. Remember, Basavraj Bomai, the chief minister in Karnataka of a BJP government, has been facing over the last few weeks multiple rumors about a possible exit. Remember, Karnataka is also facing elections next year. There have been multiple rumors since the BJP leader Amit Shah visited the state and met B.S. Yadurapa, another very senior BJP leader. Since then, there have been multiple rumors. My colleague uh, Ritu is with us right now to bring us a lot more context. Ritu will play out what Basavraj Bomai had to say in just a little while from now. But uh, Ritu, just give us more context here on what the Karnataka chief minister also had to say. Also then, Ritu, tell us, did the BJP confirm that Bomai will be their face in 2023 or have they not given any such confirmation yet? Yes. Yes. So this is one line reiterated from all the top BGP leaders. In fact, you see the former CM as well. Yadurappa too has been clari has clearly clarified this doubt of the opposition party, that's the Congress party. Yadurappa too has said that there is no change in the CM in the Karnataka. Yadurappa will remain to be the Karnataka CM as well as for the upcoming assembly polls. That. Uh, in the upcoming year as well, for the assembly poll, CM Baswaraj Bomai will be the CM till then and the state will also undergo the election under his leadership only. So that's what the top leader from the BJP party too has clarified. With all this also, you see the Congress party in fact coming up with a series of tweets and calling CM Baswaraj Bomai a puppet CM and has also said that there will be a change in the CM phase. Now with all this, you see the DK Shukumar, the KPCC president himself also saying this, this is something that we have picked from the BJP party leaders only who are speaking about the CM's change in the Karnataka. But now clearing all the air, first thing the top leader Yadurappa too clarified this doubt of the opposition party and then later point, now you see the biggest uh, statement the coming in from the CM Baswaraj Bomai himself who is saying that he is very much amused of these kind of the comments that have been passed from the Congress party unnecessarily. They are racking this issue unnecessarily. Now while you see uh, uh, the chief minister saying that the only focus right now for the BJP party is to bring in their work projects to the people, reach out to the people on the larger scale and ensure that people are noticing BJP party's work for the uh, upcoming elections and, and thus the BJP party right now only wants to focus on the productive works and nothing of these kind of a comments which will not gain the party in any way. So that's what the BJP top leaders has to say. But again, it's the Congress party who is again repeatedly speaking about the CM's change, uh, the CM phase change in the Karnataka. Okay, all right, Ritu, thank you so much for bringing us context for our audiences. Now, let's take a very quick look at what the Chief Minister actually had to say. It is amusing me. These people are trying to do time and again, and they think that they can uh, bring instability in the minds of the people. People of this Karnataka knows very well, and. Uh, they know about my functioning, my programs, and uh, they will not believe it. They have utterly failed. In fact, there is a confusion among the Congress. There are two views among the Congress about the tweet itself. Hence, uh, I am not going to give much importance to it. I am, have become Stita Pradnya. My presence of mind is very clear because it is all falsehood. Truth is that there is a stable government and it is going to be continued to stable. I have resolved myself to work much hard, much more time. Every day I am going to spend two hours more for the development of the state. 